Hey guys, so it is Saturday afternoon and I am making Noah's invitations and I thought since it was beta, I would, um, excuse me, someone just said they don't like seeing that. <laughs> so, um, anyway, so I thought I'd bring you along. So I got everything set up, I figured out how I wanted to do it. He's having a superhero party. So I'm starting with the invitations. I got a couple little things I found at Michael's. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I got. So, superhero, like uh, Spider-Man, Superman, super whatever. It's like red and blue, so it's kind of a theme. Superhero is the theme, red and bluish kind of color. So I got a pack of cardstock. It's the uh, just red, eight and a half by 11. I have my um, card cutter. I found these on actual Pinterest under superhero birthday parties or something. And so I printed them off. It's five of them, and we're only using the bang and the zap. We might use these for something else. But, um, so all I did was take my paper, put it in my card cutter like this, cut it in half. Then I have half sheets. And then we move over here, and I'm going to cut out all the zaps and bangs. So this is what one will end up looking like. So we have the three and it's raised, little pop dots, and then the bang on there. And then this one's gonna have zap and a three. So and here's our little dots right here. So there we go. So I'm gonna show you how I do it. Okay, so I cut out my threes with my Cricut. So we have a three. I'm just gonna make sure you can see me. Oh, I need to put y'all a lot. I just put my paper in here and just estimate in half. Oh man, it moved. Okay, so let's try that again. <laughs> All right, so we've got half. It's pretty close. All right. Got our half cards. Let me throw these away. And all I'm gonna do is fold them in half like this. And then I cut out my little um, thing of bobbers. And I have the pop dots right here. Probably not gonna have enough. All of them. This is still not the right. Oh well. Okay. So then I took this little thing. It's my um rolly tape right here. And I'm just going to put a little pieces on there. Alright, and then I also took some glue stick right here. And I put it on the edges because usually, with pa this is just regular paper, like printer paper. And it will peel up, so I'm just going to put it around the edges. So there she goes. All right, so I put my three where I want it. I don't have them off. Right, I'm gonna peel these off. There she is. Whoop. So there's his two cards. And I will show you some things I got at Michael's. So these I got from Michael's. This is his, his theme right here. It's just like the older, um, like superheroes kind of thing. The uh, Marvel comic or whatever it is. I got these for like a dollar, like a little over a dollar of Michael's. And these little suitcases, I have another one, but Noah has crackers in it right now. But 
I couldn't think what I wanted to do with them, but what I'm going to do is fill them up with like rocks or something and then tie the balloons around it and I have them holding the balloons around. So I thought that would be kind of cute. So I have two or three of those and four of these. I'm going to do like forks and knives and stuff like that around the table. So let's, I'm going to get everything cut out and then do an assembly line. So here they are. I've made 10. I might have to make some more. I'm not really sure. I have 10 people to invite plus some extras, but um, I just won't send them some invitations. So um, all I'm going to do tomorrow at work is print off a little, uh, like, you know, saying, kind of like, welcome to come to our superhero's birthday party or something. And um, I'm going to just tape that on the inside and uh, send them off. And usually when I do like a theme, I use um, like uh, my nephew's name is Tucker. So the address on it will say Superhero Tucker or something like that to go along with the party. So it kind of gives people hints. So that was it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions, let me know. Talk to you later.